Hi there, today I'd like to take a look at this coffee maker, the KitchenAid coffee maker. maker. Now, um, we do have this one, this is the Cuisinart, and this is my husband's, and he's had this for, I don't know, maybe close to 20 years, and we love this one, um, it's great. Uh, this one is a, does take up more space on the counter, so this is um, around 9 inches, by 11 and a half inches so you have to make sure that you have enough space for this and it's got a nice bright display there here are your buttons it's really easy to set the time and then um, you got your strength your auto clean um, you can make a small batch and we have it set at bold you have this over here Flip this open and it does have this filter. And then this. So it's really easy to just pop these out and clean them. Then, oh, it's really easy to swing this open as well. Then here's where you put your water. It's going to be hard to see anything in there. But here's the filter, and there's just a little indent inside where it sits. Here's the window, so you can see the water. And this lid doesn't come off. Um, it stays on there, so it makes it a little bit difficult to wash. I prefer the lid that just comes right off, but um, it's just a regular. And so this unit works great. Um, <clears throat> the only thing that I recommend is that uh, wash it. You need to wash it real well and then run a few cycles through. Um, even after I ran a few cycles through, there was still that new plasticky taste to my coffee. So I would say run um, at least, I don't know how long it'll take before that taste goes away, maybe 10 times um, before that taste goes away. Or I'm just super sensitive to the taste. Or um, <laughs> make your coffee extra strong. But if I can taste it, you know, you don't want to, you don't want that in your coffee anyways. The other thing is that you can choose to have it be stronger, but we found like um, our old one, if you put in a paper filter in here in addition to this one, then the paper filter just holds the coffee grounds a little longer before it drips and that in itself makes it stronger. So by doing that with just this plain one, we we, we have much stronger coffee than this. Even this um, on the bold setting still made the coffee quite weak. Now, of course, you can put, you know, a ton more coffee grounds, but then you're wasting coffee. So to get the most um, out of your money, you know, the coffee filters, the the plain paper ones are just real cheap. So just put that in there and then, you know, you can get stronger coffee than just that setting on its own. But as far as how well it works, um, all of that, all of its features, it's simple, it's great. You know, one button push, I mean, you know, it's just, it's just a regular coffee maker, but it, it is very well made and it works very well. It's just quite large, but it looks nice. So there you go. If there are any questions, go ahead and leave them for me in the comments below. Otherwise, thanks for watching.